Andrew Dye here, Unity Zoom Project in Nelson, New Hampshire. Checking in quickly here on progress. We've got painting going on inside, and the slab on the ground level is also in the process of being finished. Much of the siding has been installed. See here the rain screen siding detail that we use to ventilate behind the hardy lap siding. You can also see the extension jam details around the windows and the metal sills. There's some rough grading underway. We'll bring the grade up around the house. Notice how we taped between the wall panels and the foam insulation as part of the air seal. The slab for this lower deck has yet to be poured. That's why the posts are up on those standoffs. Here you can see more of the rough grading work underway. <coughs> This boulder will be part of a boulder retaining wall that'll kind of be off at the end of this lower deck. All right, I'm here with Ron Al at the Zoom in Nelson. He's painting. I just learned a neat trick for cutting in with a hot dog roller instead of using a paintbrush. He's going wicked fast here. He's basically painting the whole place by himself. And with tricks like that, I can see how he does it. So we're in painting mode here. And there's guys downstairs who are finishing the slab, the basement, the ground floor slab. Uh, you can see that uh, cabinets are stocked here, ready for installation. Ron L's got most of this big space here painted already, primed and finish coated. And he's going to be spraying the primer in these other rooms on the sheetrock and then finish painting them as well. You can see that we've got the finished flooring, this car's floating floor stocked in these bedrooms. Whoops. Nice light coming through these windows into this primary bedroom suite. We've got the primary bathroom here, I'm trying not to say master. Uh, There'll be a walk-in shower here. We've got the concrete backer board up for that. Looks like it's gonna be a couple of sinks here as well. The views aren't too shabby here. Out to Granite Lake. So here you can see how the electricians have used that seam between the roof panels for a wiring chase. And those channels will get covered with wooden battens, trim battens. Coming through. Got the Red Sox on the radio. He had. The more you watch him every day, the more you realize why Alex Cora wanted him so bad. Here's my player. Young one. Swing a high five ball. Slice the shallow left. Long left for two off. So can he get it? He has to play it out of half. He falls in. Top fly to drop. He tries the third baseman and they pull him in. Here we are in the connector. Big closet. Stairs down to the ground floor. Finishing the slab. I'm going to run the French meter into this room. All right. And then, um, yeah. 
you don't want to run if you run that sander without any water, it'll just, just spin right up on the thing and tear it out. Uh-huh. Watch it for what they look here. Yeah. How do you know when you've done it enough in a certain area? Just experience, basically? Yeah, or? see, like this spot here, I'm trying to watch that, that white spot. Yeah. That's where some water had sat on the concrete. And it kind of was too much water. Uh huh. And um, it was kind of run over there a few times. You never get it all out, but you can get most of it. Yeah, well, then it becomes part of the character, right? Yeah, yeah. You see, there's not much of that left now. You hear that heavy grip? Trying to work it here, though. Yeah. That's what Brian was saying. It takes one guy to manage the cord and one guy to actually sand the yeah. slab. And we end up here with a big pile. We uh -huh. have to nice. clean everything up. Trying to keep everything untangled is yeah. part of the whole process. Yeah. Let me get some water in front of me, Dad. All right, well, I'll get out of your hair, but thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate it.